on how I did my intro. Uh, you guys have requested I teach you on how I, I actually did my intro. So to start, I'm going in with the Pixhearts app. So opening the Pixhearts app, you click on the plus icon so you can pick your the picture you want to use for your intro. So I've picked the picture right now. So then picking the picture, I'll click on cut out so that I can trim out the background of the picture so it's taking it out already so now it's just the picture i have alone and i save it so that is already saved so now that it's saved i'll pick a white background then pick the picture i just edited and drop on the background then after that i'll go back to pixel and type dripping effects in then it gives me a lot of options i click on the one i want and i click on replay image also then i also pick the picture i just finished editing and i followed the process so now it's, it's just editing the picture for me using that effect i picked so you can actually increase or decrease the hdr effect and all that the artistic effect so now you place this you just follow the steps according to the, the effect you picked so you can actually adjust this according to how you want it then you click on save yeah then you click on save then exit then open pixart again so why opening pixart again this time around instead of picking a white background you're picking a green background so let's wait for the pixel to open so now that it's opened you pick a green background after picking the background you pick your last edited image which is this so then now you also click on the cut out so that you can trim out the part of the image you don't want okay so then i'm going to be using the eraser to the place where that blue stuff is to erase the the aspect that i don't really need in the picture so i just try to erase it out so that my picture comes out very well so now it's processing so now that it's fine it's okay so i place it on my green screen then i kind of adjust the crease then i also pick some stickers like i that i feel can give some touchness to the intro so i pick this so you can just click on this stuff up like a p i p or so so you can actually duplicate your stickers so, so guys all the i've placed all my stickers and i've saved them so now that i'm done with that i'll open the motion portrait app and i'll put in my last edited image so on the app so now that it has picked my eyes and my mouth i click on ok then it's now blinking my eyes are is now blinking so after that i see everything is fine then i click on the the video icon so it can be able to, to record what i'm saying so then i click on save so it enters into my gallery and that is it for the motion portraits just to put the effect of you blinking your eyes so after that we open the iMovie app into the iMovie you, you click on plus then you click on movie then you click on video you click on so in, for this now you have to go and download from youtube like an intro for you from youtube actually so i have already added this into my iMovie so now i'm trying to edit the intro so now that I've I'm here the next thing I've picked my intro the next thing I'm going to pick now is my edited image from my motion portrait so I and the way I inserted it now I inserted it as green slash blue screen like so that it doesn't show the green effects it will just appear as the white so and that is how it came out on the background now so this is the way it's actually playing because i clicked on green slash blue screen while inserting it inside this intro so now i click on save and it saves into my phone we are almost there so now that i'm done i'll go back to pixhart then 
then click on green screen again then i'll type in my name my own brand name which is okip glamour so then i click on the font i want the color you pick the color you want to use the fonts then you click on save so you also make sure you type in the things you do on your channel like vlogs reaction or lifestyle beauty etc then you make sure it's okay and it's saved in your gallery one by one don't do it together then after that you go back to the iMovie app then you click on the plus movie then you, you also need a green screen intro effect actually so then you import your your last edited intro then you also add the green screen effect using the p the green slash blue effect anyway so see the way it's not playing on the video is giving it that effect it's why you need to download that so after that now we're not insert our our what is it called our test one by one okay so using the green slash blue screen effect so see green slash blue screen effect so because it's okay glam i want it to be under the image so i inserted it just under the image then now I'll click on save so now that it's saved you will go back to your last saved video then import it then we we'll now start in, in, like importing all our tests one by one lifestyle vlog reactions as green slash blue screen uh, that is where it's meant to appear on the screen, green slash blue screen so you also adjust it because the, the length will be very long so you can actually trim it down each of them you insert you trim down so it can contain everything you do I'll insert the next one again using that plus. See, so you can see it's very long, so I'll actually trim it down so it can actually contain. Then the next one again, you just keep inserting everything you do and adjust according to how you want it and the position you need it to stay in so i think i love every bit of my intro if you have any questions let me know so guys this is just the way it's actually is coming out we are almost done now we are entering the last step after this you just click on save it's saved already then we'll go to pix arts Pixart again is going to be the last app to be used. We use just three apps: Pixart, the Motion Portrait, and iMovie. So in Pixart again, you pick a, a color you want for your channel, like intro. So I picked like peach. So then you pick 16 ratio, 9 ratio, and croppy. Then you save it into your gallery. Then you go back to iMovie. Then you e continue editing that your last video then you add this like as a picture so it's not appearing like a video so now because i want to add my subscribe icon is why i'm actually doing this so i, I go to where my subscription icon is in green and blue screen effects so then i drop it down using the green slash blue screen effects so you merely drop it down it comes out like this see it doesn't show the green color anymore because i use green slash blue screen effects so this is how i got my intro and i love this so it was pretty easy and it, it took about one hour for me to actually do this beautiful job so guys give this video a thumbs up like subscribe and i'll see you all in my next one bye guys Drop a comment if you love this and if you have any question for me. Bye guys!